Can exercise increase sexual pleasure in women? What strategies can be used to address possible discomfort or anxiety associated with anal sex? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Regular exercise can increase sexual pleasure in women by improving blood circulation, increasing endurance, and releasing endorphins, chemicals that can enhance mood and sexual response. To address possible discomfort or anxiety associated with anal sex, couples can use strategies such as deep breathing, muscle relaxation, and open communication during sexual activity. They can also experiment with different techniques and positions to find what is most comfortable and pleasurable for them. Relation to G-spot stimulation. Some women report that anal stimulation can have indirect effects on G-spot stimulation and increase orgasm intensity. Sleep and sex are interconnected. Having sex before bedtime can help release tensions and promote more restful sleep. Additionally, some people experience erotic dreams that can result in sexual arousal during the night. Relaxing effects. Orgasms release endorphins, acting as natural painkillers, which can help reduce pain, alleviate stress, and improve mood. This explains why many people feel relaxed and happy after an orgasm. Resilience. The ability to overcome adversities and maintain a positive attitude is valued by many people. Rhythm and speed. Varying the rhythm and speed of stimulation during foreplay can increase anticipation and arousal, creating a more dynamic and exciting sexual experience. Robot fetishism. With the advancement of technology, some people experience sexual attraction to robots or artificial intelligences, known as robot fetishism. Role playing. Exploring roles during foreplay can add excitement and variety to the sexual experience, allowing women to play different characters and enjoy new erotic dynamics. Role playing. Some couples enjoy role playing during foreplay, where they can explore different fantasies and erotic scenarios, such as doctor patient play, teacher student, or clandestine encounters. In rural communities in India, theatrical performances and street plays may be conducted to educate people about sexual and reproductive health topics using participatory and culturally appropriate methods. Screening tests. STD screening tests can be performed at health clinics, medical offices, and sexual health centers. And some STDs can also be diagnosed through home testing kits. Self-diagnosis. While it's important to be aware of premature ejaculation symptoms, self-diagnosis may not be accurate, as it's necessary to evaluate the problem in consultation with a healthcare professional. Sense of responsibility. The ability to take on responsibilities and commitments in life, whether at work, in a relationship, or in the community, is valued. Sensual bath ritual. Many women enjoy a sensual bath ritual as part of foreplay, which may include bathing together with aromatic bath salts, candles, and relaxing music to create an intimate and soothing atmosphere. Sex and heart health. Regular sex can be beneficial for heart health. It has been shown that regular sexual activity reduces the risk of cardiovascular disease. Sex and pregnancy. Having sexual relations during pregnancy is generally safe, unless otherwise indicated by a doctor. In fact, many couples find that their sex life improves during this period. Sex in space. As space exploration advances, questions arise about how sex will take place in space. Microgravity conditions may pose unique challenges for sexual activity. Sex toy museums. In some cities around the world, there are museums dedicated exclusively to the history and evolution of sex toys, exhibiting a wide variety of artifacts and devices over time. Sexual and gender identity. Diversity. Human sexuality is diverse and complex, and individuals may identify with a wide range of sexual and gender identities, including heterosexual, gay, lesbian, bisexual, queer, transgender, among others. Sexual education. Some people use pornography as a form of sexual education, 
although this can be problematic due to the unrealistic and inaccurate representation of sexual relations and the human body. Sexual empowerment. Actively participating in foreplay can empower women by allowing them to express their sexual desires and needs openly and without inhibition, promoting greater self-confidence in themselves and their sexuality. Sexual fantasies and erotic literature. Erotic literature has been a source of inspiration for many people in their sexual fantasies. Erotic stories can allow people to explore scenarios and experiences that may not be possible in real life. Sexual Motivations, the University of Texas, conducted research identifying 237 different motivations for having sex. Interestingly, having children and relieving tension are no longer the main reasons. Other motivations include getting closer to God, burning calories, returning a favor, changing the topic of conversation, and even getting rid of a headache. This study demonstrates that human sexual motivations are extremely complex. Sexual response cycle. The traditional model of the sexual response cycle includes four phases, excitement, plateau, orgasm, and resolution. However, this model can vary in each individual and may not always follow a linear pattern. Sexual role-playing involves taking on characters or erotic scenarios during sexual activity. It can be a fun way to explore fantasies and desires. Sexual toys in antiquity. Sexual toys have a long history. Ancient dildos and vibrators dating back thousands of years have been found in different cultures. Sexuality and gender identity. Sexuality is inherently linked to gender identity, but it is important to remember that gender identity does not determine a person's sexual orientation. People of all gender identities can have a wide variety of sexual orientations. Sexuality and art history. Sexuality has been a recurring theme in art throughout history, from prehistoric cave paintings to modern representations in contemporary art. Sexuality in old age. Sexuality does not disappear with age. Many older people enjoy an active and satisfying sex life and may continue to experience intimacy and pleasure as they age. Sexuality in old age. Sexuality does not stop with age. Many people continue to enjoy a satisfying sex life in old age, although they may face different physical and emotional challenges. Sexually transmitted diseases can have a significant impact on the sexual, reproductive, and emotional health of affected individuals. The stigma and discrimination associated with these infections can hinder the seeking of medical attention and necessary support. Shockwave therapy for erectile dysfunction. Shockwave therapy is a non-invasive treatment that uses acoustic waves to improve blood flow to the penis, which may help improve erectile function in some men. Silent infections. Many STDs, such as chlamydia and gonorrhea, may not present obvious symptoms, leading to unnoticed spread and increased risk of long-term complications if left untreated. Sleep benefits. Masturbation before bedtime can help some women fall asleep more easily as it releases relaxing hormones and reduces stress. Smell and attraction. The sense of smell can influence sexual attraction. A person's natural scent, their pheromones, may play a role in sexual chemistry and attraction. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality,